How do we treat these? So what we'll do is take an x-ray. We already explained why. We measure certain angles. We look at certain load uh, characteristics of the foot and how it responds to weight bearing. Um, and then we'll do a clinical exam. We'll see which muscles are tight, which are loose. We'll check your ankle. We'll check your hips because believe it or not, hip range of motion, hip stiffness and strength plays into how your heel strikes the ground and how you walk. And a lot of times we can tweak bunion pain by making your gait a little bit more smooth and powerful by treating what I call the kinetic chain all the way up and down the leg. Um, at the end of the day, we may say, yeah, you actually need surgery. And at that point, we either do a fusion, connecting this bone to this bone if it's severely arthritic. We do a realignment surgery. We might just do some soft tissue re reconstructions. And I showed you that algorithm so you know that it's very variable, heavily dependent on you, your characteristics, and what your x-rays look like in your clinical exam. You can take pain medicines. I'm not a fan of narcotics in any way, shape, or form. Um, I'll use them if I have to postoperatively, but there's much better ways to treat pain. Um, anti-inflammatories, I'm a big fan of natural treatments of pain, natural anti-inflammatories. They're very powerful and not talked about enough. Um, very safe. They don't damage your gut. They don't kill your gut biome. They don't attack your kidney um, and your liver. So that's another alternative. You can do alternating cold and heat. You can do things like stretching, toe yoga, contracture releases. So sort of fascial oriented massage techniques that will actually release the tight fascia that's drawing the toe over. And you can do therapeutic techniques to strengthen the muscles that hold the toe this way. Um, and that goes down to deep tissue, fascial releases, dry needling, things that the physical therapists are awesome at. Um, you can actually do Botox to paralyze the muscles that are bringing this toe over. And I've done that for um, high level athletes that really can't have surgery. They can't afford to have a change in their foot structure. So we just paralyze a couple little muscles that bring the toe over and then tape them. And then people can go on to play football and soccer and things like that. Um, and then taping and bracing techniques.